In Tuvalu, we are living the realities of climate change, sea level rise, as you stand watching me today at COP26. We cannot wait for speeches when the sea is rising around us all the time. Climate mobility must come to the forefront. We must take bold, alternative action today to secure tomorrow. Faftailasi, Tuvalu Modetu. Climate change and sea level rise are deadly and existential threats to Tuvalu and low-lying atoll countries. We are sinking, but so is everyone else. And no matter if we feel the impacts today like in Tuvalu, or in a hundred years, we will all still feel the dire effects of this global crisis one day. In Tuvalu, our islands are sacred to us. They contain the mana of our people. They were the home of our ancestors. They are the home of our people today and we want them to remain the home of our people into the future. This is why this call to you from Tuvalu is not just a political statement. It is a call that reverberates from our eight islands and our 12,000 people to the international community. We are petitioning and demanding that global net zero be secured by mid-century, that 1.5 degrees be kept within reach, that urgently needed climate finance be mobilized to address loss and damage and that there be greater accountability from all nations and peoples to act as good stewards of the earth.